all know there's power in a story, but do you use storytelling to deliver your message effectively? I'm here today with Ruth Sherman, and she's going to tell us how to do it. Ruth, thank you for being here. It's my pleasure, Marcia. Happy to be here. So, you're a great storyteller. Thank you. What do we all need to know? <laughs> the first thing you need to know is that because we're all in technical fields, certainly mortgage bankers are in a highly technical field, you want to be sure that you don't overwhelm your clients or your intended audiences with technical information. We all love that technical stuff, the numbers, the, the statistics, the research, but you, it's going to make your client's eyes glaze over if you present them with too much of that. So you've got to make it come alive with some storytelling. So you mean I don't have to remember all the data <laughs> that I'm presented with? I can tell a story? You know, the more you can tell a story around the data, like what is in it for them, the WIFM factor, the better you're going to be. The, the WIFM factor. The WIFM factor. What's in it for me? That great acronym from, I don't know, like 30 years ago. But what's in it for me is really what you should always be thinking about when you're talking about anything having to do with when you're selling, when you're out there selling your, your expertise, your services, whatever it is that you want people to buy, whether it's an idea, a, a product, a service, whatever it is, if they can't feel it, they're not going to act, but a story will make them feel it. What's the best story you've ever used? Oh my gosh, that's putting me on the spot here. So the best stories are personal stories. So stories about how you might have made a mistake somewhere along the line and what you did to correct it and how you came to success after that. Or some places where you struggled and maybe, you know, were having difficulty figuring out how to get around that struggle or to beat that struggle. So personal stories are best. We don't want it to be too much information, but we want people to know that they are not alone. They're not alone. In other words, you've had that experience too. You know what, it's, what they're feeling and you know what would make a difference for them through your own experiences. It's not just about the numbers. It's about being able to tell a story that's relatable to your audience. And if you do that, your message will resonate. Ruth, thank you so much for being here. My pleasure, Marcia. Thanks for having me.